Welcome, Leos. Okay, Leos, let's see what's coming up. This week is the week of the 27th of February until the 4th of March. All right, let's give you a little shuffle and bring the light energy um, on your cards before we move forward. Um, please remember to like and share. Leos, I think you're coming out of that seven years period bad luck, okay? All right, so Leos, we're going to be first focusing on what is the three more so affected things in your life, okay? What is going to be affecting um, you, Leos, in this week? I was shuffling these and um, they started coming up in reverse and I don't read these cards in reverse. So, okay, I'm not like Rissets. <laughs> now we're going to kiss you now. So, Leah, what's going to be happening for you guys? So you are in um, the Pisces season. The Pisces season has begun. Go check out your Pisces season reading. It is good to check out the Pisces season readings, okay? All right, Leah, let's see what's coming up for the Leah's in this week, okay? I see you, Leo, uh, married men are coming out. I see a whole lot of money. And I see sadness, Oh, see, sadness. So a lot of you, Leo men, if you're marrying, if you are having a business, there could be some sort of a problem where a lot of you, Leo men, have to repay a whole lot of money, okay? So um, it's definitely Leo. Some of you could be dealing with a scorpion, a Leo or a scorpion. Um, changes is going to be coming up for a businessman. Uh, number three, the thirtieth, um, is really um, affecting. There's a lot of sadness for some of you, Leo men, who are either divorcing or some sort of a huge um, loss. It could be um, loss in some sort of a, um, what's that now? Loss in some sort of. A, um, the stock market. This is like a whole lot of money, Leah's. Okay. Um, this is like, it's not only money, but it's like wealth. Okay. So you could have put, um, a whole lot of money. This could also be, is a week. Um, a lot of you are going to be lost, losing a lot of money by gambling. Okay. So, um, if you are married to a Pisces, a Pisces can to a scorpion man. I see the spurs is coming up in this week. The spurs is now going to be recognizing how much money um they could have a loss. Okay, two cards comes out. Um the six of swords communication. Um a lot of secrets is going to be coming out. So Leo men and women, but this is more like going to be affecting the Leo men. Um, in this week, okay, so it can be Leo men, it can be um, Taurus men, okay, so these two came out together, so obviously this person had a lot of secrets, okay, the energy of the eye princess, and this situation for some of you Leos have to do with uh, um, an Aquarian person, an Aquarian person is very sad, hmm? Um, you could be in a relationship with an Aquarian person, um, communication, an Aquarian person is going to be recognizing that some sort of a communication that you, Leos, had given out. And there is a lot of secrecy. You, Leos, are going to be finding out that uh, an Aquarian man had a lot of secrets, okay? Whoever this Aquarian man is, whether you're in a relationship or not in a relationship, this Aquarian man is going to be recognizing um, that uh, Yulia's had a lot of secrets, okay? I'm guided to do Yulia's reading in another way, okay? Okay, so I'm going to cut the deck in um, four. I'm just, guy. I, I don't know, there's something for Yulia's out there that wants to know something. I was guided to cut the decks in four. All right, so let's look at this uh, man, yeah? So they're looking at a Pisces Cancer or Pisces Cancer or Scorpion businessman, whoever this man is. For some of you, you could be divorcing this person. Some of you, um, it could be a boss. For some of you, this could be a businessman. Whoever this man is, uh, 
they're now shedding and gaining a lot of information. They're looking at this person, corporation, institution, and could have gained some sort of a information. The Queen of Swords, a Gemini person, they are seeing the connection between a Pisces Cancer, a Scorpion person, and a Gemini woman. Now, is this um, this lady husband? Yes, it can be connected as family. Um, this is the energy of the Six of Cups. It can um, be a past life situation um, that uh, some of you, um, this Scorpion person, this is a Scorpion man, they're coming down and looking at this Scorpion man and his family, okay? Um, Julius could have been dealing with the Scorpion man um, and is now recognizing what was going on. It's as if the Scorpion man and his family, um, and they're really looking at this person company. It is a Scorpion man. Um, the energy of the Aerophant is has to do with uh, business, um, corporation, institution, um, and they're deeply looking and getting involved. And I see a Gemini woman is going to go after this corporation, okay? The energy, they're recognizing how much money a Leo woman have stolen or taken or uh, whoever this Leo woman is, is in a whole lot of problems. The secrecy, I said... This uh, this is a situation where the energy of the eye princess, there is something going on in the universe and the frequency that is going to be coming up in this week that has the energy of revealing secrecy. And a lot of people, five of cups is going to be basically regretting a situation. Okay. Um, and regretting the situation because they could have done something and whatever they have done is now going to be coming out. So a scorpion is going to be fired. Mars in a scorpion. And a scorpion is going to be fired. There you see the energy. A scorpion is going to be fired. There you see the energy of the Gemini. So um, whatever is going on, this energy there, you're seeing the energy of the Gemini and a scorpion is going to be fired. The Ace of Wands, a young Scorpion, is going to get a new start. And the thing about it is that this young Scorpion person, and it is affecting you, Leos, because you, Leos, could have done something against a young Scorpion person and created a whole lot of issues for them, and they're going to be resolving the situation. Then we see overcoming a problematic situation that was going on. Um, you Leos are really trying to overcome this problematic situation. Um, and I see you Leo women, especially if your boss's supervisor is going to be overcoming the secrecy um, that was kept because it's as if people are getting involved and finding out what was going on. The energy of the nine of ones, I see... Um, in the house, I see protection is going to be coming up. And they're now gaining an understanding of a Sagittarian, how a Sagittarian mask a mind, a secrecy, until it is now out. No success is going to be um, coming up with groups of people. So be aware of this. And then no success is going to be coming up for a cancer neither. Um, because they have recognized what this cancer have done. So um, normally, um, a cancer is now starting to talk. Well, this cancer is, is definitely talking. Um, and this person is talking and people are hearing. The seven of wands is an energy where you Leos are trying to stand your grounds in order to get some sort of a new start. Whatever is going on, I don't... No, but you see, the situation is uh, um, Julius wanted to move forward, um, maybe together with a cancer person, maybe together with someone else, but it's not going to be working out because whatever is happening is that people are like recognizing because it is, uh, yeah, Mars in Leo, Mars in Cancer, 
Mars in Leo, uh, Mars in Scorpion. Um, so when we look at the situation, do you see the energy of uh, this Gemini person? This Gemini person um, is going to make the decision to fire a Scorpion and a Leo. Okay. So it is basically a lot of you at the workplace, because I see this corporation is protecting, or I see this boss is protecting this corporation, and is basically um, protecting someone from a real disaster or situation. A corporation is now recognizing who is the queen of one. So you Leos, um, a corporation is recognizing some sort of a travel documentation, car, licenses, and it's protecting someone. Okay. So if you recognize Leo, so they're now looking at you. And I see you Leos um, are now regretting a situation. And I see protection is coming up. Because um, a Sagittarian man is protecting either a Capricorn business or a Capricorn. Okay, nine of wands. The moon is in Sagittarian. And a Sagittarian is either trying to protect their business or they're trying to protect a Capricorn. But whatever is going on, if you are in a relationship with a Sagittarian, Man, they are protecting either their business or a Capricorn, okay? Because they now recognize a whole lot of disillusion. A lot of major arcanas have been coming up in this week for a lot of people. And you guys are dealing with your boss or your supervisor. This is definitely a boss or a supervisor. They are recognizing, and a lot of you who are married to a cancer man, this cancer man and his family was looking for some sort of a new start. And it's as if they have a Leo Chow. Use this Leo Chow to gain some sort of access someplace in order to get to that place. And people now recognize what has transpired. So in the house of money, they're going to be um, investigating a whole lot of money from this cancer man and his family. Because they're recognizing that this cancer man was basically paying the road, paving the road. They're going to be start looking at this person and his wife books, okay? And this is um, really going to be uh, um, something that is going to be coming out. Um, you Leo women, if you had secrecy surrounding a scorpion, it is going to be coming out. You Leo women could be creating some sort of an illusion, but the scorpion is still going to get that new start, okay? Because in uh, the house of the scorpion, and especially young scorpion, younger than 45, is going to get this new start. Because, you know, people are going to be stepping in and it's going to be recognizing how wrong this situation was. So, a Leo woman has um, took a whole lot of money. A Leo woman... Um, because you Leos, you Leo women, um, there is something between you and a Sagittarian and a lot of money. Okay. And uh, there are secrecy. There are a lot of secrecy. You Leo women who are married to an, um, to an Aquarian, no success for you and this Aquarian. Okay, because you Leo women were trying to um, create some sort of an illusion. Um, and it's as if they see what was going on. You Leo ladies wanted, it's like a new car or you wanted to travel or move forward. A corporation is going to shut it down. Um, and... Here, people in authority is now recognizing um, Leo women and Leo men. Leo women and Leo men. And I see um, a Sagittarian person 
um, is going to be protecting a Capricorn person because the Sagittarian person is now recognizing that whether it's their mother, their friend, their, their um, you know, whoever this person is, uh, they're going to be um, really protecting a Capricorn person. There's a lot of people that is standing their grounds and because whatever the secrecy is, so th th there is so much sadness. And this is Mercury, Mercury in uh, Mercury, Mercury in Aquarius, Mercury in um, Aquarius. And this Mercury in Aquarius is that an Aquarian could have recognized the secrecy of you Leo men or and, and, and or the secrecy of you Leos or the secrecy that you Leos was creating and bringing them in. So it could be your husband, Leo. So, so if you're married to an Aquarian, could be your husband. There's a lot that is happening. So this could be your husband. Um let's break this down because um the secrecy of a gemini woman who was trying to get some sort of a new start is not going to be happening because they're protecting a, a this is the tent house and there there is protection in the tent house a man is really standing up and said no 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 and is protecting someone in the tent house and it can be someone at the workplace. It can be a, um, someone career, someone business, uh, because the truth is coming out. And it is as if uh, they're recognizing what a family has done. They're recognizing that this um, problem and this situation could have been something from the past. So if you notice this energy of the Six of Cups is Venus. So Venus, Venus is in a scorpion. And whenever Venus is in scorpion, ladies and gentlemen, this is about the sun is in scorpion. Okay, so the sun is in scorpion. And I and, and this is like a young scorpion because it's as if you Leo men that create some sort of a problem, illusion, um, form a tear, a situation, took a whole lot of money because they're now recognizing where a whole lot of money went. It's like they're going back and they're looking at details and information and recognizing the money was never gone to the right person. And they're going to be recognizing where a whole lot of money went. So, um, you know, whatever is going on, they're going to be recognizing that a Sagittarian person has been creating a lot of illusion to get over the Virgo for a very, very long time. And I see um, the the new start that this Gemini, because this Gemini woman is in the reverse. And it's as if the Sagittarian woman was trying to give this Gemini woman some sort of a new start, but using a Capricorn data and information, and they're blocking it. Because people in authority is now recognizing that the Sagittarian woman has not been basically, this, this woman has been selling um, this woman makes a lot of money and, and, and makes a lot of money by selling data and information under the table. This has been something that has been going on because I can remember a couple of years. This thing was coming up. And if you notice, it's like a corporation is now recognizing, you know, um, how this person could be profiting and manifesting and gaining so much, um, they're recognizing that they were basically selling um, people data and information. And there's twice the energy of the eye princess in this week, Leo's. Um, there's a lot of uh, um, secrecy that is going to be coming out if you're in a relationship, um, your partner. Um, uh, this is uh, listen to your intuition. Um, this is a situation where a problematic situation is definitely going to be happening where a lot of you Leah's, um, in relationships, so, um, you and your husband could be, uh, or wife could be coming in, um, uh, prob problems. Okay. And whatever is going on, this energy of the eye princess, so, um, 
is is showing you um that uh, and I, I see um it's as if you Leos are going to be recognizing or uh, you Leos are now going to be gaining some sort of understanding that communication um of someone was not based on facts so it could be information that you Leo gave out was not based on facts and they're going to be recognizing that so um i see a lot of you Leo men are now going to be recognizing that um the communication that you gave up it's now been checked and they're now recognizing oh no oh no okay um so this is going to be transpiring uh A lot of you Leos are regretting some sort of a you Leo women, you're really sitting in your house, okay? Because this is the house of the Leo. Really sitting in your house. And whatever is transpiring Leos, they're looking at where you got so much money from. Especially Leo women, I don't know what is going on, but they're investigating where you Leo women got so much money from. And they're 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 getting to I don't know what you Leo women had got yourself in, but this is a really emotional situation because it's connected to a scorpion family. So if you are connected to a scorpion family, I see this family is going to be turning their backs to you Leos, or the scorpion could be turning their backs to you. If you're in a relationship with a, a cancer. A scanser could be also turning your back, their backs to you, Leos. But the thing that you need to look out for is an Aries man in a corporation institution because this man has a lot of secrets and it's all going to be coming out. Whether this Aries man is in this corporation institution that has all of the secrets, whether you, Leos, are connected to this man or not is going to be coming out. The other thing you need to look at, especially you, um, there is something about a car. There, there is a situation about a car. Whatever that is going on about a car, you Leo men, um, they could be like holding on on your car, seizing your car. Okay, so Leo men, be aware of this. Your car could be seized because it's as if. You have to give up how you came on this car. So some of you, Leo men, your car could be seized. Um, there's some serious issue that is transpiring. Okay, really serious issues. Um, so be aware. Mm -hmm. Um. A lot of you are dealing with your husband. I see your husband. No success. Um, there are emotional issues at the home in this week, Leah's. If you have a child that is a Gemini, they could be a stop, charge, getting some sort of a, um, tickets or so. Gemini person. And there is, if you have a child that is a Gemini person, there is regrets. There's a lot of regrets. Um... There is so much regrets that is going on. I see a lot of you are trying to stand your ground um, against a situation concerning money, against a situation. You're trying to stand your ground. And it, it, it is as if, you know, people are now just um, so recognizing that whatever that is going on, um, they're investigating how you, Leo women, came on all this money, okay? And they're also finding out 
if you are connected to a Gemini woman, they're going to be finding out how you Leo women and a Gemini woman could have gotten a new start. And whatever is going on there, it doesn't look, um, it, it, it is not very positive. I should say it is not a very positive situation. Okay. Cause there's, there's a lot of, there's a lot of secrecy. The eye princess brings out secrecy. Okay. But it can also be intuition. Okay. So, um, here, the sadness that some of you Leos are feeling is communication that was given out that was not based on honesty and reality. Okay. Um, and, uh, huh. I see that this situation is very funny, Leos, because the situation is actually very funny. Um, it involves a whole lot of money, Leos, a whole lot of money. And it's as if you have to give up and tell where this money is coming from. Again, go on. Namaste.